Welcome to the Wine Guy, Wine of the Week, and we've got two rather premium wines this time, but two stonkingly good styles. First up, we have Pine Ridge, and this is a Chenin Blanc Viognier blend from the other side of the big pond, America, Napa Valley, California, and that's a 2011. And the second one we've got is from Chile, and this is from the Aconcagua Valley in Chile, and this is a single vineyard Carmenere from Erosuris. So, first up, Napa Valley. Napa Valley is famed, famed for Cabernet Sauvignon, a big, complex reds. Those big reds that beat the Bordeaux reds in the 1976 Judgment of Paris Tasting and Beyond. However, they're now starting to produce some exciting whites, Sauvignon Blanc and now Chenin Blanc and Viognier. Chenin Blanc is a great variety at home in the Loire in France, done very well in South Africa, and now I'm pleased to say the Americans are doing it well as well. This is 79% of that grape. And then there's a little touch of Viognier in here. And Viognier is a great variety at home in the Rhone Valley in France, uh, making great styles like Condrio. But Viognier is very floral and very intense, and Chenin is very acidic. So these two grapes really complement each other. And when you get your nose stuck into this, it's exactly right on the money. Let's have a smell. So it's fresh. There's a lovely Chenin Blanc apple note there, that really Granny Smith green apple. But then there's this lovely aromatics, this kind of white, flowery acacia note. There's that little bit of sort of hawthorny touch to it as well. You've got aromatics. There's a little bit of slightly riper peachy touch here, that white peachy touch as well. And that's that Viognier coming through. It's a delicious nose. It's just crying at me to get stuck into it. So I'm going to have a taste. Mm. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wonderfully high acidity. Now this is Napa Valley, which experiences lovely cool winds coming off the Pacific, going at the San Pablo Bay, and it cools down these vineyards. So you get nice zesty flavours from the Chenin Blanc here. Uh, very green apple very zesty, and mouth-watering. And the Viognier just fattens it up a little bit. It gives it a little bit of body and a little bit of texture. Um, that's wonderful. Moorish. You just want to taste another... I'm going to have another glass, because that is absolutely lovely. Mm. Wonderful, absolutely wonderful drinking this one. Green fruit, zesty, long length. This is a wonderful fine one, about 15 pounds this one. Let's move on to the red. And the red is from South America. So this is the Erosuris Single Vineyard Carmenere. 100% Carmenere. Uh, and what I love about this great variety is that the Chileans are now calling it their own. However, originally from Bordeaux, but Bordeaux only produces a very small amount of this grape now, so the Chileans have really taken this grape on as their own, their own identity, and they're doing it very well. Above £10, it's really exciting. This one's about £15. Uh, and what we get from Carmenere, it's a bit like Merlot with a bit more guts to it, a bit more intensity. A lovely, deep colour, and the nose... Very dark fruit, very dark cherry, black currency, but then there's this lovely dollop of mocha coffee, this chocolate and coffee and a bit of spice. Oh, that's very, very good. A little bit toastiness here from the oak uh, this wine has been matured in. Aconcagua, the part of Chile where this wine's from, certainly makes the most forward styles of wines. And on the palate... Mm. So deep, full flavoured, but a big softy. So very, very intense. It's got some tannins in there, good acidity, not overt, but then all this wonderful ripe flavour comes out. Black fruit, lots of black fruit, very dark, almost cassis, like liqueur black fruit. And then a lovely, smoky, spicy coffee finish on the length. That is an absolutely stonkingly good wine for cold weather. This is a winter red. Tasty stuff. This is my red wine of the week. Erosur is Single Vineyard, Carmen Air 2010. Cheers, and please remember to subscribe.